all NYPD officers have taken an oath to protect and serve. But now the department is looking into whether or not two of its members have taken a different oath, a pledge of loyalty to the far-right extremist group, the Oath Keepers. The very same group accused of being a part of the insurrection, storming the nation's capital earlier this year. We need a full investigation, and there will be a full investigation, uh, to find out exactly uh, if any officer involved, how are they involved, what did they do, what did they say. Mayor Bill de Blasio says any ties to Oath Keepers will disqualify the officers from serving the city. PIX11 has learned one is an officer, the other a sergeant, assigned to the Strategic Response Group, or SRG, a unit that responds to major events in the city, including the civil unrest during Black Lives Matter protest. Civil rights leader Kirsten Foy. This man who was put in charge uh, and given a position of leadership in response to protest is himself an oath keeper who denounced and does not believe in racial equity. And so there must be a reckoning within the NYPD. Oath Keepers was founded in 2009. Over the years, its members branched off, changing views, and is now more radical. Organizations that are trying to destroy our democratic freedoms uh, undermine our nation, undermine our people. Um, that's very, very troubling to me. And troubling to retired NYPD Chief of Patrol, Wilbur Chapman, who spoke with us by phone. Being a police officer is not a civil right. It's a privilege and an honor. And it comes with the responsibility of protecting all of those in the city and being colorblind. Any police officer supporting any controversial group does not sit well with New Yorkers. That would be very concerning. As long as they're fairly investigated, if it comes up that it's true that they were actually there and participated in the insurrection, then they should be removed. Again, the mayor says he will conduct a full investigation. In the meantime, the NYPD said in a statement, the incident is under internal review. In lower Manhattan, Nicole Johnson, PIX11 News.